Hey guys, it's me Amber and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a take my makeup off with me. Kind of also showing you guys my skincare. So let's get into it. Right, so I'm doing like the emoji makeup trend challenge. It was like a trend quite a while ago, a bit late to this trend. But I did this look today. I'm doing them all over on TikTok. I was going to do it on YouTube, but it just makes more sense to do it on TikTok. So check me out on TikTok, but I'll show you the emoji that inspired this one. And I need to take this off. It's literally like 29 degrees outside. My room is absolutely boiling. I'm so ready to get this off my face. Okay, so first step is always lashes. And then I look completely different. So I'm just gonna put this back on the lash thing. Do you know what I wanna get? I seen someone with this on TikTok and it was like, instead of re like just using these plastic ones that just come with the lashes, they had like an actual like big thing that like they bought and it just looked really cool. I always have to put my hair back because obviously I have a fringe and I'd end up missing half my face. So I use this. I'm gonna try not get makeup on it, but as you can see the makeup goes up quite high so it's a bit difficult <laughs> oh also it's fine if any of the product gets in my hair because i'm actually washing it straight after this video which is why i like brought it right out to my hairline here because i knew my hair was getting washed okay so this is the first product and it's the number seven radiant results nourishing melt melting gel cleanser so it just looks like this and it's actually really nice. I most likely always, most likely, I seem to always use way too much. So um, I'll probably use about this much since I don't have, actually, I have concealer over my face. I do have a lot. And I just like rub it into my hands and then go all over my face. I probably haven't done enough now. I do stay away from my eyes because when it gets in your eyes, it makes your eyes feel really cloudy and you can't see properly which is not the best. You're definitely not meant to get it in your eyes, but sometimes it like accidentally goes in. I wanna get these face paint bits though. Okay, I need more. Oh, it's all in my hands. I used to weigh too much. But yeah, I really like this product. It's like way too much. I don't, I've done purple today, as you can clearly see. Um, So I'm scared if it's gonna stain. So I hope this helps with that. Okay, I'm going to head to the bathroom and just rinse my face with water, just literally just plain water, and then I'll get back to you guys once this is off. Look, this is how my face looks right now. It feels so gross. It feels so thick on my face. Like, it's good, but I hate the feeling of it. It's just like a cleansing balm thing. The main part of my makeup is now off. Obviously, you can see my eyes, everything is still on. I have water in my eye as well. Now I always use my face halo. I love this thing. And you are meant to just like use just plain water out of like the tap. I'm gonna go with my Garnier. <laughs> I'm gonna go with my Garnier. Oh my days, how many times am I gonna have to say this? Um, the Micella Cleansing Water by Garnier. Just because I feel like this mascara I put so much on and it is quite a pain to get off. So oops, I'm sorry, I'm not showing you, but I just put like a little bit on here and then i do do this all over my face as well just in case there's anything that i missed but i really love this and it's so much better rather than just using a single use cotton pad because that's like really wasteful if you like having to use like two or three of them at a time um just because they're so small and you know when you can just get one of these well they come in a pack of three um, and I really like these or I saw some like I don't know what brand it was but whatever material this is I forgot what it's called but this basically but in a cloth form which I kind of like the look of because they are a bit bigger so I might be getting some of those possibly okay looking at my face I don't think much has stained which is actually a big surprise normally anytime I do purple or pink I get stained so bad so I'm a bit shocked don't know how I managed to get away with that but now my face is clean, kind of. <laughs> right, I use these two face washes. So first I have the simple moisturising face wash. Um, and I have the simple smoothing facial scrub. Um, I don't know which one should I use today. I feel like I'm going to do the scrub. Because I, I use this like twice a day, unless 
I use this because I do this to try to I try to do this in the morning and night. Sometimes I forget. Um, but we're gonna go with this face scrub. So I'm just gonna go wet my face. I do also have my little flannel here, so I'm not spilling water everywhere. But I'm just gonna use a little bit of this. Probably gonna use about this much, and then I just literally do this all over my face. I do focus on this part of my forehead because I always seem to break out here. So I do like to give that a bit of a scrub. Um, but I've been breaking out there a lot, which I'm not really sure why. And I like to focus like here, just because like um I always get like blackheads on my nose. I really want to get some of those blackhead peel pore strip things. Maybe I'll get some of those. But they really hurt. They always hurt when you have to peel them off. So not a big fan, but also do want to get them. Um but not a huge fan. Now this is all scrubbed in, I'm gonna go back to the bathroom and rinse it all off because I do not want this sitting on my face. <laughs> my face feels so smooth. <laughs> so normally after that I go straight in with the rest of my skincare routine. However, as, wow, look at my fringe, I should have left that in. Um, but as I am washing my hair right now, <laughs> I don't see the point in doing that right this second and then going and washing my hair because I will get water all over my face and I feel like it would just be quite pointless because the moisturiser would just like wash straight off my face. So I'm going to come back to you guys once I have washed my hair. Oh, I have a bunch of... Um, grips in my hair that's why it's not coming out oh gosh I actually have quite a few I feel like I have one here also my fringe isn't up like this because it's dead it's like dead it's because it's greasy it doesn't normally do this and it's been pushed back let's go wash my hair and I'll be back with you guys okay my <laughs> my hair is washed um I'm gonna let it I haven't brushed it yet maybe I should brush it I'm not gonna brush it. I'm gonna brush it after the video because I'm also letting it like naturally dry because it's way too hot to hair dry it. But back to the skincare. <laughs> For moisturizer, I use this simple hydrating light moisturizer. I need to get a new one. I've literally nearly run out. But I use quite a decent amount of this. I'm glad my hair's wet because I don't have to use a headphone because it does just go out my face. <laughs> and then I put this everywhere and always do it down my neck as well sometimes i use this sometimes i don't i literally have the tiniest bit left um so yeah but today i am it's the youthful replenishing oil by number seven yeah i don't really know what this does but i just like to use it i probably won't get a new one um i don't even know how much it is this was like a christmas gift it like came like a i don't even think anything just came out of it it came in like a skincare set, so I just used a little bit of that. And finally, my favourite lip balm, which is the Pink Grapefruit um, Lip Butter by The Body Shop. I love this so much. I can't open it now because I've just got moisturiser and face oil on my hand. I cut all my nails down, so now it's so easy to get this out because it's like so low down. And it just go like under my nail and it was gross, so... <laughs> Bonus to having no nails. Got a bit of a fringe going on now. I'm actually gonna get rid of it because it's kind of stupid. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and liked it. My hair looks terrible right now. It goes really dark when it's wet. I don't really know why, but it looks really orange as well. If you did enjoy, please leave a like, subscribe, comment down below what videos you wanna see from me in the future. And I will see you all soon with a another video. <laughs> Bye. Oh,